Welcome back to Fox Tech. Today we're tackling a common issue that can be quite frustrating for iPhone users. The Wi-Fi button is grayed out. This usually means that the button appears on your screen, but it's not clickable, essentially preventing you from connecting to Wi-Fi networks. Let's dive into what might be causing this issue and how you can potentially fix it. First things first, if you encounter this problem, a good initial step is to simply restart your iPhone. This basic troubleshooting method can sometimes clear up minor glitches or software bugs that may be causing the Wi-Fi button to be unresponsive. However, if a simple restart hasn't solved the issue, we'll need to look into more specific solutions. One effective method is performing a hard reset on your iPhone. To do this, quickly press and release the volume up button, then quickly press and release the volume down button. After that, hold the power button for about five to 10 seconds until the Apple logo appears and the device restarts. This type of reset can sometimes resolve deeper system errors that a regular restart can't fix. If the hard reset doesn't bring back the functionality of the Wi-Fi button, the next step is to reset your network settings. It's important to note that doing this will erase all your current network settings, including saved Wi-Fi passwords and Bluetooth connections, so proceed with caution. To reset the network settings, go to Settings, tap on General, scroll to the bottom and select Transfer or Reset iPhone, and then choose Reset Network Settings. This process can help resolve issues related to network configurations that might be causing your Wi-Fi button to be disabled. Another area to check is any possible restrictions set up on your device. If you or someone else has set up screen time or content and privacy restrictions, these settings could be restricting changes to network configurations. To investigate this, go to Settings, select Screen Time, and then tap on Content and Privacy Restrictions to see if network changes are being blocked. However, it's important to address a more concerning possibility. If the Wi-Fi button is still grayed out after trying all the aforementioned solutions, it could indicate a hardware issue. When hardware components like the Wi-Fi module fail, they can cause the system to no longer recognize them, leading to the grayed out button you're seeing. Unfortunately, if this is the case, no amount of software resetting will resolve the issue. Your next step should be to take your iPhone to a professional technician or an Apple store to get it checked for hardware problems. Thanks for watching this video on Fox Tech. If you've tried these steps and either solved your problem or need more help, let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more helpful guides and tech tips. We appreciate your support and feedback. Peace.